What's going on, YouTube? What's up? So, I gotta do that whole like so, like thing. So, so. <laughs> <laughs> we have to keep you no know, trends going, you know? Yeah, I don't have the beard, unfortunately, as much as I did. Uh, yeah, yeah, you can't Rightfully whack it off. sit in this seat, but regardless, we're at the end of the year. Um, as you saw last week, Goat showcased his top five tracks of the year, or at least most. Most listened most, to. Most listened to. Yeah, most listened to. We explained the parameters. Do you want to give uh, another uh, refresh on those parameters? It has been a week. I, we're lucky to remember yesterday. Yeah, yeah. All right, so we got no cover songs. Yep. No repeats by an artist, or if it's off the same album. If we made a video earlier on in the year, it there automatically go. disqualifies See, itself. the two of us can put together yeah, one yeah, brand. Yeah, there we go. We got this. We are but, two halves of one idiot. <laughs> but so last week was all goat. Mm-hmm. You guys enjoyed that, love that. I love it. I usually sit back there mm. and bring you guys the content here. And now I'm sitting here, but I put the yeah, it's yeah, a yeah, it's whole a, fourth wall thing coming yeah. on here. Very metal. But we're coming into my week, Sky Week. Yeah, <laughs> that doesn't have a weird thing to. These are named yeah, and yeah, then yeah. Um, as a bonus because these guys decided it was going to be a bonus. Uh, next week you're going to get mine. Yes. So, and, and so, you and I have very similar. Fives. Yeah. <laughs> which, yeah. Which As you is will why, see. Yeah. As you will see. But we've already jabbered enough. Mm -hmm. um, what are we doing for your number five? So number five is When We Were Young by Architects. Yep. So let's go ahead and uh, do the thing. Do the thing. Oh, did they do that slow walk-in thing? Yep, the walk-in thing. <sighs> Damn those bands. Really, Sam? Took his time. Still. Oh, there we go. Looks so unenthused. <laughs> I like that clear hit. Yeah.
Yeah, man. <laughs> I forgot how good that song is. <laughs> <laughs> You're welcome. Every time. Oh. No, but I actually like this album a lot overall. It obviously it's it wasn't it's not my top one of my top albums right. here, but the, there was a lot of especially the singles, they were very enjoyable. Yes. No, it was a little bit more I would say a little bit more metal than the previous album. Yeah. And I think I think the previous album was a good precursor to this. Yes. No, they were starting to get into their you no know, the sound that they wanted to be um, post Holy Hell, obviously. Yeah, and I was gonna say Holy Hell really kind of set this whole thing into motion. Yeah, it really did. You know, like that was kind of the it, it was a complete removal of what they did previous to that, mm -hmm. and then it was a good complement to what they did for the follow up, mm -hmm. and then this is I feel like it's taking the best of those two records and just with the inclusion of synths and backing tracks mm -hmm. too. No, I, there was a lot of industrial esque vibes throughout this whole record. I think one single. I like I heard like a strong Rammstein yep. influence. I'm like, yeah, that song sounds like I've heard that somewhere else by a different band. Mm -hmm. But no, like, there, there's nothing wrong with influences. No, but, not at all. And I liked uh, my takeaway from it was that Sam really just went into the cleans, mm -hmm. those like mid range slam. Oh, I love the fact that Sam is like putting a little bit more focus and emphasis on his clean vocals mm -hmm. than his you no know, scream vocals. Um, which oddly enough, I was, I said that during Holy Hell and then the next album dropped. I'm like, Oh my God, they listen. Mm -hmm. And now we got this, which yep. is that, that perfect blend of the last two albums and actually solidifying the architects, well, at least the new architect sound, mm -hmm. which we can only hope that this is where they're headed mm -hmm. and staying on this path for a minute. Yeah. Um, cause I feel like if they were, they would be doing a disservice to both themselves and fans mm -hmm. if they were to decide after this record, Hey, let's go back pre, yeah, pre holy back, hell. Yeah. Let's go back. Metal core. <laughs> let's like, go back to metal core. And it, cause like, I, I'm not going to lie. I wasn't as much into architects as I was until holy hell. I, I will say the same thing. I was, yeah. Holy hell is what sold me on them. And then these last two records, has done. The, I I prefer the previous one to this one personally, but we talked about that yeah, yeah, off broke, camera yeah. for a minute. But yeah. uh, um, lyrics. Yeah, I mean, I, I think uh, obviously we're getting older. No, <laughs> we can't stay eternally youthful forever. <laughs> but obviously, the title when we were young, a lot of the lyrics in this were like, yeah, mm -hmm. this is yeah. Yeah, and then we'll get into it, and we're gonna get into it right now. So and, let's do this thing. Oh god, the intro. Oh, one, two, three, four. Yep. Really? Okay. Well, you were very young. Yes, sir. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So first one, we're separated by a margin of a greater degree, the same flesh and blood, but in a different lane. I read the remedy too, but my words they still sounded the same. All right. Yeah. But it really hits harder in the chorus. Oh yeah. Chorus. When we were young, we thought we had the whole world figured out. Now all we do is speak in tongues. Yep. We play in a we play a losing game. Only now we hear the shouts fading out. We flew into the sun. Yep. And there were apparently you know, at one point in time some annotations there. Yeah. But I think that's pretty to the point. It, it, it's pretty <laughs> self-explanatory. Yep. <laughs> and then obviously the post chorus we flew into the sun. Oh. Yep. yep. Oh. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> and then verse two. I'm dedicated to the shadow that's been following me. It caught me countless, counting the cards. I guess the rules remain. Oh, it was heavenly then, but the devils were calling my name. Yep. Of course again. Of course again. And the bridge. Is there something in your eye? Did you fall or were you just on a high? <laughs> Everybody's so afraid they could die, but they never once said, thank God we're alive. Yep. Yep. And then just pretty much a refrain after that. Yeah. I love that. That bridge was mm -hmm. just... It speaks a lot there. Especially the last line. Thank No, last two lines. But they never once said, thank God we're alive. Mm -hmm. No, especially playing with the whole when we were young. We all really did think that we had everything figured out. Yep. And I love the whole, that you know, did you fall or were you just on a high? Mm -hmm. I, I can't tell you how many times in my life where it's felt exactly that. Yeah. Where it's like, is this just a dopamine rush or is this how it's supposed to be? Yeah. And then it looks like one more course. And we end on the course again. So, yeah. Architects now is they're pretty much reflecting on the whole you no know, history of you no know, themselves the band. Um, obviously, you no know, Holy Hell was a very emotional album, mm -hmm. um, which you no know, kind of set up the I don't want to say the, the departure, but it started. It was the first steps to maturity for me. Maturing yeah. 
for which is why we got these last two albums. Mm-hmm. The sounds that they got. Yep. And I, I've we've heard this for years, mm-hmm. being musicians ourselves. We've been told this even. It's you know you do your first couple albums mm-hmm. to get yourself out there, build your fan base, and then you really start to put your own self into your preceding records. Yeah. Personally, I don't. I, a band really doesn't become themselves until after that first trilogy of albums. Mm-hmm. Yep. Which, that's why, like, from what I've seen, the fourth album tends to be the one on the downside. Mm-hmm. And they kind of bounce back on the fifth. Yep. That's how I've just... Yeah, exactly. That's how it's it's historically proven. We've both been in bands that have done that in ourselves. Like, how many years does it, has, does it take our, us as musicians to have found what was us? Yeah. You know? and, the, and that's the the beauty of like maturing and like, getting older. Like the sound, the, the sound that you started with, obviously, Architects being a metalcore band, they are no longer that metalcore band now. No, and they couldn't like even when they do uh, shows and you see them doing those old metalcore mm-hmm. songs. Yeah, like there, there's a handful of people that yeah. are like, yeah, but it's people are there for this. Yeah, right here. Oh, especially given the fact that the entry point for a lot of people was Doomsday. Mm-hmm. No, that's where they go from. Like they start here, and then they they're with these out set of albums, not this old backlog right. discography. And they so. they did the same thing. Like Bring Me the Horizon did that. Bring Me the Horizon comes out as this full on deathcore. Then they go a slightly mainstream or posse. Yeah, kind of. And now they're starting to bring back. back the metal, but even in their own shows, like when they play like Pray for Plagues or something like that, like. It's a medley. <laughs> it's a it's a medley of like old songs and like a lot of these newer fans are like, what is this? Yeah, like I, I can't tell you how many times people have been like, oh, you like Breathing the Horizon? Yeah, like this is when I found them. Yeah. What is that? And I'm like that that is the Breathing the Horizon I know. Yeah. Like <laughs> you're slamming in a pit. You're not singing these Elver Hartfield lyrics. Yeah, <laughs> and Architects is kind of in the same that same boat as Breathing the Horizon. Mm-hmm. Exactly. So Architects when we were young, mm-hmm. number five. On Skylar's week yes. of most listened to tracks of 2022. Mm-hmm. Stay tuned. You got four more. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> sorry, not sorry. You got some <laughs> good stuff coming in here. So uh, until next time, YouTube. See you guys on.